All right, we are already in second place. Let's see what else we can do over on the pod. Whoa! <laughs> no, no turtling allowed. Uh, are you a turtle or a Yeti? <laughs> Welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of Toucan Plays Monster Jam Steel Titans 1. <laughs> and we are playing as Yeti. I don't know if these dice blocks are worth more, but uh, it, it seems to be like there's an added challenge of trying to hit all the dice blocks. So I'm going to try and do it. <laughs> Moving from side to side. Now, I have not mastered this loop to loop. Even with uh, Chocolate Drive giving me a little bit of advice. Well, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad, but I did lose my combo. And I have found that there's this little stockpile right here, and it gives me a big boost of uh, dice blocks. And let's see if we can... Uh, oh, I, I lost it. I wasn't keeping my momentum up. That's all right. That's all right. I think we're going to be okay either way. Oh, yeah, here we go. This is going to be my best run yet. I've been practicing a little bit off camera. Oh, yeah, baby. Nice. 142, and that did put us in first place. Nice. All right. So for my troubles, I did get a whole bunch of upgrade tokens, which I absolutely need if I'm going to play as Yeti in career mode. I got a little bit of a bonus for coming in first. And I unlocked El Toro Local Challenge number three, got 800 bonus rewards, and I've got a whole bunch of upgrade tokens. All right, so just to do a little recap, we did finish the outdoor racing 100%, the arena trials 100%. We are moving on to the arena championship, which is going to be a long, long haul, but let's get started with it. And as you can see, I've already started upgrading Yeti a little bit, but I do need to get at least this third tier of upgrades. Ah, uh, one one shy on these third tier of upgrades in order to be competitive in this uh, in this arena championship series. But let's get started with it. That was a nasty growl. Listen to that. Oh, and the blue, <laughs> the blue uh, pyrotechnics. That's really cool. And there's Yeti, man. He looks mean. <laughs> And there's Northern Nightmare. I think I'm the Northern Nightmare, man. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Nice. Perfect start. I think I'm starting to get my timing down on that. So what we're going to do is we're going to do two cities, just like what I did with the last Arena Championship in Steel Titans 2. We'll do two cities at a time. Whoa. <laughs> and then we'll do one outdoor race just in quick play. I think it'll be a lot of fun just working our way through the career mode. Now, I may have to ch take a little bit of a break here and there to uh, upgrade, you know, just do some of those El Toro local challenges and get some upgrade tokens. I'll get some along the way, too, but I, I think I am probably going to have to take a little bit of a break every now and then to get some more upgrade tokens just because, you know, I don't want to play the same truck every week, week after week. You know what I mean? I think you guys would get bored with it. And I know I would get bored with it. But there we go. Northern Nightmares out of the way. Next up, son of a digger. Let's see who we're going to go against in the finals. My guess is going to be Max D. Dude, I just love the roar. Oh, those blue tar pyrotechnics are so cool, too. They did a good job with the showmanship in Steel Titans 1. I don't know why they didn't translate that over into Steel Titans 2. Like, man. <laughs> There's son of a digger. Ryan Anderson in there. <laughs> Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, man, yes. I'm totally getting the timing down on that. I feel so good about that. Here we go, round and round. Salt Lake City is pretty much the same as uh, it is in Steel Titans 2. Just a big donut. I don't know if that's the way it was in, uh, what, 2019 or 2018, whenever this was developed. I think Salt Lake City is a little bit different nowadays. There we go. Whoa. <laughs> nice little, <laughs> nice little loop-de-loop -loop to finish it off. Nice. Son of a digger out of the way. Moving on to the finals. And it is going to be Max D. Here we go. 
Here we are, final, <laughs> final round in Salt Lake City, facing off against Max D. <laughs> so epic. Three, two, one, go. Oh, nice. I thought I was going to be off a little bit, but I made it. Oh, man, I don't, I can't tell you how happy I am that I'm starting to get the timing down on that. Oh, Max D is giving me a run for my money. Don't cut it too, too sharp. I don't want to hit that crush car and go flying because I will go flying. One more lap to go. Here we go. Come on, come on, come on. I've got about a two second, second and a half lead. And there we go. Nice. Head to head racing champion Yeti. That is me, baby. And there is my trophy. <laughs> All right, moving on to wheel skills. And here we go. It's nice. I've got uh, I got an audience here. <laughs> got Dragon and uh, Mohawk Warrior and El Toro Loco. Is that Chip Chocolate? Hey, little Chip. You watching me in El Toro Loco? <laughs> here we go. Three, two, one, go. Not that it matters too much in uh, two wheel skills here, but hey, it gave me a nice, a nice run into getting that uh, big air sky wheelie right there. Let's do some donut action. Donut and a cyclone. Very cool. So once I get one of those combos, nice. One of those two-wheel skill tricks, then it doesn't really matter. Why, why didn't that wheelie count in my last combo? Doesn't really matter. I'm already in first place. But yeah, once I get a two-wheel skill in there, a wheelie, a stoppy, uh, a sky wheelie, anything like that that's a, that's a skill on two wheels, then I can do pretty much any kind of a trick that I want to do after that. But hey, you know what? We got first place with just one of our two wheel skill combos. That's all we needed. Man, lots of upgrade tokens and I got a nice first place bonus. Let's move on to freestyle. Yeah, normally in Steel Titans 2, we would have a time destruction between two wheel skills and freestyle, but there is no time destruction events that I know of in Steel Titans 1. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just like the El Toro Loco challenge maps. Correct me if I'm wrong, because I am still a newbie when it comes to Steel Titans 1. Whoa! No, I'm turtling. <laughs> oh. Combo failed. <laughs> Here we go. Let's try that again. That was a nice little start to it. Ah, whoa. Okay, I'll take that backflip. There we go. Come on, go back, go back, go back. There we go. What? Okay. <laughs> that was a crazy reverse flip. I'm already in first place. I will take that. I don't know. Mr. Yeti, you are doing some crazy stunts. That is one thing that is really wild about this game is the physics. <laughs> oh, come on. Here we go. Hello, hello, El Toro Loco. Hello, Dragon. Hello, Mohawk Warrior. And hello, Whiplash. My audience. Let's come on over here and we'll get... Oh, or we won't. Or we'll just, you know, we'll just do a little backflip and a bicycle right here in the middle of the stadium. I want to come over and get a backflip off the backflip container. We'll hit this one up here because it's got a beacon. Here we go. Oh, got a little stuck. Uh, I don't know what happened there. Maybe, uh, I don't know. I don't know what happened exactly. Ah, turtle thing again. Come on, Yeti. Work with me here. Work with me. I want to do something that has some wow factor. Let's try and get a nice backflip off this backflip container. Come on. Here we go. There we go. Wow, a double backflip <laughs> off the backflip container. That definitely has the wow factor. And we'll do a little uh, do a little roll action there too. Why not? We'll hit the eight pack here. No backflip, just a little sky wheelie off the eight pack. And I think, oh no. Yeah, that's gonna do it right there. Now I'm on my back. Combo meter is gonna run out. Timer is out. And that is all she wrote for this freestyle event. Nice. First place. Got a first place bonus. 
3,000 upgrade tokens. I don't know if that's enough to uh, buy into tier four of my upgrades. Let's find out. Hey, I do. I can buy one. Let's see. What do I want? To, I'm going back. I'm going into Denver and it's going to be a head to head. So I think I'm going to want uh, acceleration. Yeah, to get up to my top speed as fast as I can. Denver. Wow. <laughs> I love those pyrotechnics. That's so cool. Whoa, fireworks going all over the place. All celebrating me, Yeti, the blue marvel. Hey, do me a huge favor though. If you've been enjoying this series, smash that like button. It really does help get these videos out to more people. It lets me know that I'm doing a good job and that you want to see more Monster Jam Steel Titans action. Uh oh, I didn't, I didn't count, but hey, I got the timing down perfect. Nice, I forgot to do my count though. So this isn't quite a donut. Whoa. This is definitely different than the Denver in, um, is there a Denver in Steel Titans 2? I can't remember. Yeah, there is, It's but it's a stadium. It's not an arena. So yeah, this is a little different than the, uh, the, the well, there isn't one. There isn't this map. This map doesn't exist in Steel Titans 2. This will be interesting. It's a new course for me. It is, it's not quite a circle, but it is kind of an oval shape. Oh, and it's got just a big pod in the middle. Huh. All right, Northern Nightmares out of the way. Who's going to be my next competitor? Son of a digger again. And oh, Max D versus Max D Black. I'm going to guess that Max D is going to go all the way to the finals with me. Let's find out. There's Yeti. <laughs> Beware. Uh, this is so cool playing trucks that didn't exist in Steel Titans 2. After playing Steel Titans 2 for literally a year, like almost every day for a year straight. Three, two, one. Oh, there we go. Perfect straight. It's it, a perfect straight, perfect start. Anyway, after playing Steel Titans 2 for almost every day for almost a year straight, it's it's fun going back to Steel Titans 1 and, uh, and playing as trucks that I've never been able to play before and playing on tracks that I've never played before. This is actually a lot of fun. See, so yeah, this track, it's, I don't know. It's like a rounded box is what it is. And I'm glad that I got that acceleration bonus because I have completely caught up to Son of a Digger. <laughs> nice, Son of a Digger is out of the way. Who are we going against in the finals? It is gonna be Max D, let's do this. I swear the fireworks get bigger every round. <laughs> he looks like a monkey. <laughs> oh man. And there is Max D. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Oh yeah. I love it when I get that timing right. You know, between the bonus from getting the perfect start oh, and having my acceleration uh, bumped up a little notch, I feel like I'm, I'm just roaring out the gate, which is awesome. And I am catching up to Max D. Hey there, Max D. I see you. I'm coming for you. Not to worry. I'm just a Yeti. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> thank you, thank you very much! I am the best Yeti driver there is! All right, Yeti versus Max D. Yeti has won. I now have my trophy. All right, moving on to two wheel skills. This is gonna be fun. So like there is just a big pot in the middle. It kind of reminds me of Wichita in uh, Steel Titans 2, which I think has just a big pot in the middle too. There's the hairy beast. Three, two, one, and go. Oh, I was way late on that one. Let's hit the log stack. Nice big air sky wheelie. That is my good two wheel skill for that two wheel combo attempt. Whoa. <laughs> Got another nice wheelie there. We'll come down here. We'll get a stoppy and a moonwalk. Nice. This is kind of awkward doing that on the tires there. Let's come over and get a donut real quick. No. Okay, but you know what? The donut is going to count in my second two-wheel combo attempt. Whoa, nice big air. And oh, I landed a little funky. Can I get up? I cannot. 
No, it didn't count, but that's okay. I got enough points in my first combo attempt to get first place, so I will take it. Beware, Yeti seen in area, monster jam, fire and ice. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna be moving on to freestyle, and I think for freestyle, I wanna have a little bit more traction. So let's do that. To be honest, I don't even know what, what traction and stability, I don't even know what they do. Bounce? Do I want to be more bouncy? I don't think I do. Like, I get acceleration and top speed, but bounce, traction, and stability, I don't really know what those actually do for me, to be honest. But, uh, I don't know. Let's find out. We're going to add points to traction, and uh, we'll move on to freestyle. Let's do it. Yeah, there's Blue Yeti. Blue Yeti, that's the name of a microphone, isn't it? I think it is. Go! Oh, it was early. That's all right. Let's get a nice big jump clear across that pod. Oh, landed in a wheelie. Let's come over here and we'll get a backflip off the backflip container and a corkscrew. They didn't count any of it. And another corkscrew. Like, if they're going to let you do these crazy moves, at least they need to let you count it towards something, right? <laughs> I don't know. Some more beacons. Oh, yes. Into a bicycle. Oh, good. I'm, I'm glad they counted that because that was a full on bicycle there. Let's try and get a backflip off this backflip container. Nice backflip, double backflip, <laughs> but I missed the beacon, so we're going to try this one more time. Can I get another double? Oh, I can't. I landed it in a, in a stoppy. Let's get it back into a moonwalk, shall we? Nice. Nice. Wow, I don't even know what I did there. I just accelerated, and all of a sudden I did a corkscrew, just, just because. All right, we are already in second place. Let's see what else we can do over on the pod. Whoa! <laughs> no, no turtling allowed. Uh, are you a turtle or a Yeti? <laughs> Combo failed. That's all right, that's all right. Let's come over here. We'll get a backflip off this backflip container and get this beacon. Nice, another double. Nice! Oh no! I landed in a turtle, but I did get the combo that counted, so uh, I'll take it. Okay, come on. What are we? Wow. <laughs> All I was doing was accelerating, man. <laughs> uh, are there any more beacons? I don't see any more. I think I got them all. That's okay. Whoa, whoa. We'll focus on the technical tricks. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that three times combo is going to be it because my time is up. Oh, that didn't even count. Boo. <laughs> there we go. The audience still loves it. I still got a perfect 10 from my score. Yes. And I got a nice little bonus, too. All right. So I am the overall winner in that uh, Denver area. And I've got 48 points in the series standings. And that is uh, what? 12 points ahead of Max D, so I've, I've got a pretty good lead right now. All right, so interesting, I found in Quick Play, there is time destructions in Quick Play, so obviously the time destruction mode exists. It's just not part of the Arena Championship in the career mode, so maybe maybe down the line, as part of a different championship, it will, uh, it will give me Arena, uh, it will give me time destructions as an option, or as a requirement, rather, to complete. So we're going to do here, this is Salt Lake City, and this looks almost exactly like the Salt Lake City time destruction uh, in Steel Titans 2, which, yeah, that's kind of boring. I wish it would be a little bit different. I wish that in Steel Titans 2 they had made it different so that I could come here into Steel Titans 1 and play something different, but oh well, I get what I get and I don't throw a fit, right? I can imagine Yeti throwing a fit. He's going to throw a Yeti fit. Rawr. <laughs> now, my buddy J Pace, he is the expert at time destructions, man. He has got a whole series of videos teaching you how to do time destructions. If you get a chance, make sure you check out J Pace's channel. He's got a great Monster Jam channel. All kinds of cool Monster Truck, Monster Jam, Steel Titans 2 related content. 
give him a go. Only finished second place in that time destruction. I, I was uh, maybe not trying as hard as I wanted to. <laughs> I should have tried a little bit better. All right, here we go. We're going to do the Denver time destruction just because just because you know this one is definitely one that i've never done before because i don't think denver is in steel titans 2. wiggle the tires for good luck and i'm gonna focus and i'm gonna get this challenge done i'm gonna get first place man three two one go nice there we go oh yeah definitely have never done this one before oh well okay that will work for me No. Okay, good. Stay, stay, stay. Yeah, the darn crush cars. It's the same problem in Steel Titans too. The crush cars don't count, which is just a. I mean, they count, but then the you know the uh, combo meter just disappears so quickly when you hit that uh, the crush cars they don't they don't count as well and and like i said before in previous videos i get it it's to prevent cheating because you could just like you know rock back and forth across the same two crush cars like right here i could just go back and forth back and forth if they count it as a full you know combo meter thing but i don't know they need to count a little bit better than what they are <laughs> all right i did get first place in that time destruction I will take that. And you guys know that I always like to finish my videos with an outdoor race just because they're fun. So we're going to do the Coyote Arches Waypoint Race. This is one I've done recently. It didn't let me choose my difficulty. Oh, it did. I take that back. I'm doing it on medium difficulty. I probably should have switched it to hard, but eh, I don't know. We'll see how I do on medium first. Oh, no. Too busy talking, and I didn't get the time right on the... Uh, on this start there it doesn't matter because i'm way out ahead of everybody i definitely should have done it on hard <laughs> oh well this will be a nice easy win and give me lots of points to put towards the truck that i'm going to do later in the week this video is going to release on tuesday i always like to do one on tuesday one on friday be sure to check out the video on friday when it comes out See which truck I'm gonna drive on Friday. I think I'm gonna stick with the fire and ice theme. I have to find a nice fire truck to play as. Maybe Mohawk Warrior Fire. Whoa! Whoa. Come on, come on, come on. It's so hard to get up. And they put me all the way back here? Are you kidding me? Sorry, I'm not going to complain about it being too easy anymore. <laughs> Looks like everybody went off this rock. Some people took the high road, some people took the low road. I'm just going to go right down the middle and smash into a tree. Yeah, that sounds like fun. <laughs> Come on, Yeti, you're killing me. You're killing me, Smalls. And everybody's finishing. And I'm going to be dead last, of course, because, oh, uh, because of my own poor driving abilities. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> that was still fun. Uh. All right. I do think that is all the time that I have for today, though. Yeah, the Yeti looks so striking. Uh, blue against all these uh, the sand and the red rocks. Come on, get up, Yeti. Get up. Get up. Oh, Yeti. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching, though. I really do appreciate it. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Check out the video that you see on your screen right now. And hey, we'll see you guys on the flip side. <laughs>